lovely spot we found here. Just, uh, just the other side of Biritz, out in the country a little bit. We had a hell of a drive last night, or late yesterday afternoon. We hit Biritz right at rush hour. Wow, <laughs> it wasn't good fun. Um, we sort of wanted to go that way. We'd half had a mind of spending the night in San Sebastian and uh, having a look around the town. But we changed our mind. The figures, the figures for the um, amount of daily infections when we looked it up were just so high that we decided not to risk it and keep, keep ourselves to ourselves as we've been doing all the way here. Um, generally not taking any chances at all to mix with people which is a shame uh, but you know that's the way it is at the moment at least we're out able to uh, travel and uh, you know just do a little bit of our exploration as we planned and what better place can you find than this look right down on the river nice little spot pretty level Pretty flat. There is a water point here, that's about it. We're going to head off to Bergerac, planning to stop in Bergerac overnight um, and then go up to just outside Limoges. Hopefully, button down. We're just about to leave Port de Lan, where we've had a fabulous night. It's a lovely little place, really peaceful. Had a few cars come in and go, but nothing, nothing really to worry about. Beautiful uh, view across the river there. It must be a bit tidal here, but we're very close to the sea. So we're gonna head off um, to Bergerac as our planned next stop, and um, we'll do a bit of filming along the way. lunch spot we found what a super smart lunch spot tables and chairs lots and lots of shade fantastic right in the middle of a little village uh, we're about a hundred 102 kilometers south of Bergerac and where do we find it well we found it on parkfornight.com really good app worth having on your phone even if you're just traveling around camping somewhere really is an excellent app. We're going to push on in a minute and um, carry on up to Bergerac. Not quite sure what we're going to do in Bergerac, whether we're going to stay there or move on further north. Our friends are just outside Limoges. It's about another uh, 80, 100 kilometres on to them from there. So stay with us and we'll take you on to the next bit of the trip. Dully. What do you reckon to this place? It's a bit wild. They've not seen it yet. Ooh. 
<laughs> it's a bit wowzer. Okay. So, are we going to make them wait to see it? I don't know. I I think I think I we think go we should let it squeak see it first. Yeah, I think we better um yeah make you wait a little bit to see it. We'll we'll put some other film in between. So this is the Castle Stroke Chateau. Stroke Church, I suppose. Stunning place. We're gonna have a wander around the little village and see what, uh, what else is going on. photography allowed inside the chateau um, which is a great shame but uh, I suppose you have to buy the guidebook make one I don't really want religious no I meant to the village oh. <laughs> God. you just can't get the staff <laughs> can you well I think it's a very pretty chateau definitely a very pretty chateau I think you picked a good spot for last night's week yeah, I think this yeah. is probably one of the best spots so far. I don't know, I thought the view in Rioja was hard to beat. Yeah. Yes, I suppose so, yeah. I don't we've know. We've seen, seen some lovely places, haven't we? Yes, we have. We've, we've picked a few corkers, I think. Thanks very much for watching this video. Don't forget to like and subscribe and also hit that notification bell. That'll give you a notification of the next video in the series as soon as we launch it. Next time we take you on a day out that's very special. See you soon. Bye.